Tell you the truth, today I was supposed to upload a music video, but because I'm a total utter klutz, I deleted the video. Oh my god, what a dickhead. You know what I hate? When people slag off your favourite musicians because they don't like them. It's ridiculous. It's like saying, ha ha, you like Justin Bieber. That means you're gay. Really? If I was gay, what, what would it be to you? I think it's down to jealousy, people hating, I think. Why do it? I have many friends who are fans of Justin Bieber and Nicki Minaj and all that sort of stuff. Personally, I'm not into it, but I never personally want to make someone cry or upset just because I don't like Justin Bieber or I don't like Nicki Minaj. I'm a really big Blur fan and, and if someone says Oasis are better, then so what? I mean, they probably actually are right, but still. I think the worst thing about this whole Justin Bieber thing is haters come up with this way of making Bieber fans really annoyed by making up this rumour called Cut for Bieber, which is one of the most saddest things ever. Because if you think about it, if you say Cut for Bieber, and then all these girls actually do start cutting themselves, then it's, it's mad. I'm doing that, don't I? Wow, I should be a moose. Mm, shut up, Sam. I mean, if you think about it, Justin Bieber is one of the most successful musicians in the world right now just because of his fan base. If he didn't have a fan base, he'd just be a, a normal teenager like you and me. I'm guessing you're a normal teenager. But anyway, this is totally, totally, totally off topic. Today, I'm just going to be talking about things that you shouldn't do, on, like hating, for example. Another thing that really annoys me is when people put their number on Facebook. It just seems in this day and age where the internet's such a powerful tool that you would resort to putting your number on Facebook or your Skype on Facebook even. Skyping is so gay because you can cancel and you can like delete requests. But a phone number, that's something that you can like get, get to anyone. It's kind of messed up. Ask FM, talking of messed up. Oh, Jesus. Ask FM is one of the most annoying things ever. It's lovely, you get, you know, compliments and stuff sometimes. People kind of make themselves look really slutty. Pretend to be people, I'm rising, sorry. Um, pretend to be people in Ask FM. And it's like, well, it's kind of sad because you kind of think that they're not happy with themselves, they have to become some totally different person. This one is kind of off topic too. Last week I was at school. And I walked into the RT suite, and there was a year 11 girl in there. I'm, I'm in sixth form myself. I was with my best friend Jodie. We went into the room. I was talking to Jodie. When I get overexcited and have something to say that I really want to get out, I kind of garble. Garble? If you know what I mean. Vomit out words. That's disgusting. And then she said, Why can't you talk properly? Hang on. Why can't I talk properly? Well, what's it to you anyway? Why do it? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Well, this girl was so rude and so... I won't name her name because that's just harsh. If I do say her name, I'll get really pissed off. I guess the whole point of this video really was... One, think about it. And two, if you don't have anything decent to say, or nice to say, don't say anything at all. Um, this video has been really weird. Thanks for watching guys. Sorry it's been a really strange one, but yeah. Do us all a favour. Shut up Sam. Alright then, bye.